Oh my fucking god, time for a new vlog. How the fuck are we doing today, guys? I'm doing awesome and sexy and super fucking baltastic terrific. <laughs> oh, today was a very long day for myself, and uh, today was actually a gorgeous fucking taste. Every single day this week has been actually pretty good. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty good weather. <laughs> Alright, so anyways, as for RuneScape shit, uploaded a new video uh, uh, couple, uh, fucking like five hours ago, then had to run out and shit. Um, basically uploaded a little money-making guide. Haven't made a money-making guide in like fucking uh, like um, a month. Has it been a month? Or maybe it's been like a couple weeks. But anyways, basically... Um, Made a little guide of a uh, little money-making method I will basically pretty much be doing once I finish fucking these goddamn quests on this game. Uh, basically it's killing green dragons. The most simple, basic thing of it all can actually make you a ton of fucking money on this game. Whether you choose to range them or melee them or really do whatever. Uh, just completed the quest, uh, fucking the Grand Tree or Tree Gnome Village. Right now, I'm training butt-fucking agility at the Genome Stronghold 225. Because I was unaware that I needed 25 fucking agility to do the grand suck my dick hole fucking tree. Well, actually level 6 now and shit. Um, so I'm not really sure if I'm going to be able to do the fucking Monkey Madness quest. Probably most likely will get around to it, but probably going to be uploading a RuneScape video uh, as well and shit. Just talking about some interesting crapola. Anyways, yeah. Uh, fuck. <laughs> I really do hate training agility. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it, it sucks balls. Especially when, especially when you have to fucking train it to do a quest. Which is why that my fucking present day RuneScape account can get a quest cape like that. It's because I have every fucking skill needed to do every single goddamn quest on the entire fucking game. Um, as for 2007 RuneScape, no way! Ah, uh, no, 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 no! Train your agility. Train your fucking agility. Even though I, oh yeah, the reason why you train your agility is because you gotta use a shortcut. But still, it fucking kind of sucks. Um. Otherwise, uh, yeah, I mean that's basically pretty much about it. Uh, tomorrow is Friday. Going to be uploading a fucking shit up video, hopefully with a dragon scimitar. Now, nah, nah, I, I, I should have fucking monkey madness done by tomorrow. It just sucks fucking balls um, that I literally have to do this retarded fucking agility because, well, it's just fucking retarded. <laughs> that's, that's the only thing I can really say about it. Alright, so anyways, today, or rather late this night, early this morning, whatever the fuck you want to call it, today, <laughs> we're going to be talking about botting on RuneScape. We have made many videos talking about botting on RuneScape, but today we're going to be talking about something fairly interesting, and that is a uh, bot-free zone fucking week. Let's say that the powers at B of Jagex Studios uh, basically fucking said, um, we're going to make it legal for you to auto on RuneScape starting from Monday 000 till Sunday fucking 11.59pm. Uh, um, so basically from that time frame, you are allowed to auto on RuneScape, which um, is kind of like... It's it's kind of like a, a double. Okay, we're making we're making fucking a little more realistic because one week would never probably happen. Let's say one weekend. So for one weekend, you're allowed to basically auto on RuneScape. Uh, well, actually, no, that 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 really isn't that long of a time. Okay, fuck it. We'll say one week. <laughs> it really doesn't matter how long it goes. Let's just say Jagex hypothetically says, um, you're allowed to bot free, you know, without getting caught and violating the terms of service, so they totally remove article whatever in their terms of service, whether it's article 10, 12, whatever, uh, basically saying, oh, in level 8 agility right now, we're well, almost there, my friends, um, basically saying you can now fucking auto on RuneScape between this time period. How many of you motherfuckers would auto on RuneScape? Let's see, let me answer the question for you. Probably about 99.9999999% Would I auto on this game? The only reason why I would not auto is because of video making sake. Um, if I wasn't a fucking YouTube video maker, 
And if I didn't fucking, like, document my shit on fucking the internet, and if Jagex said you could auto for one week without getting in any trouble whatsoever, and everyone else was autoing, I would fucking auto for one week. But because I make YouTube videos, and because I document every single day on fucking RuneScape, it would be kind of fucking stupid if I literally only played RuneScape 25 hours, I mean 25 minutes out of the day, but yet I had a bot going on my computer for, 20, for 24 fucking hours, you know, doing whatever. Um, so, I mean, that's the only reason why I would choose not to do it, but I'm pretty sure that a ton of you guys would fucking love to do it. There would be so many motherfuckers with 99 fishing. There would be so many motherfuckers with 99 uh, uh, mining. There would be so many fuck many motherfuckers with uh, strength, defense, I mean, magic, fucking, uh, just, uh, fletching. I, is there a fletching bot? I don't even fucking know. Um... There would be so many people with so many different 99s, it would fucking destroy the game. I mean, I, in my personal opinion, it would probably most likely just fuck up. I mean, okay, destroy the game. I say that very, oh, we are level 9 agility. Yes! <laughs> ah, fucking, um, d destroy RuneScape, I really don't think so. But make it unbalanced, absolutely. Um, and, you know, fucking RuneScape is as unbalanced as it is right now and shit. Uh, well, present day RuneScape. Uh, 2007 really isn't unbalanced. Give it about maybe two, maybe a year and a half, two years. It will be fucking unbalanced. Um, but for the most part, uh, it, it would just really fuck up a lot of shit on this game. And, of course, I, I hope, hopefully Jagex never allows this. But hypothetically speaking... There would be a test, I mean, so many people would auto, it just, it wouldn't, it would be called Botscape. More than people auto right now and shit. Uh, but how many of you guys would actually do it? I'm pretty sure probably a lot of you guys would. Um, there's nothing wrong with fucking doing it, it's just your personal fucking preference. Do you want to accomplish something without actually doing it? Um, or would you want to actually achieve something with you physically achieving something? Because... You can get a 99 fucking woodcutting cape with it with a goddamn bot, and you won't have the same feeling that you got the cape with, you know, by chopping willows. The feeling I'm talking about isn't a great feeling. It's a feeling of wanting to chop off your hands and fucking feet and shove them up your ass. Because you just chopped 187,000 fucking willow logs. Congratulations! You're fucked by Jagex! <laughs> then one month later they come out of ivories. Don't you just love Jagex Studios? <laughs> uh, but anyways, yeah. Um, if there was a bot free zone, it would definitely fuck up a lot of shit. And uh, it, it just, it, it definitely would in my opinion. But uh, let's uh, pray that that day never fucking happens. Whoop, 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 level 10 agility. <laughs> All right, guys, right now, uh, like I basically said, and <laughs> we just gained fucking 11 agility. Yes, uh, you know, I'd be training agility to 25 uh, because I need to do this fucking retarded ass quest. Then after that, going to do the quest, probably go sleep, tomorrow do Monkey Madness, and uh, make a new fucking shit up video in general. But otherwise, right now I'm going to go to my email address to rest some happy hooba hooba questions from you motherfuckers. Ask them at yahoo.com to me, you who's because if you do, well, everything will require you to do agility, <laughs> which will fucking suck. Fire super hooba question. Hey, how's it going? It's me, Ether, from Stronghold, where we train together. Here's my question. Do you think that because of the major increase in the engine and graphics for RuneScape 3, that RuneScape might uh, soon be coming to consoles? If it does, how much do you think it would cost, and how much do you think, uh, and how much would you be willing to spend on it? Thanks, RS username, uh, uh, Ether, or that's the way you pronounce the username and shit. Um, okay. Uh, actually, I think this, this motherfucker was actually the guy who suggested the, uh, console, uh, fucking vlog. And yes, I actually do remember, uh, uh, yes, do remember you had a stronghold and shit. And, uh, the Michaels. <laughs> the fucking Michaels. Um... Uh, do I think, no, it's not gonna, you know, like, like I basically said in, a, in a, a vlog a couple days ago about it coming to consoles, it's not going to. How much money am I willing to spend to play RuneScape on Xbox? 
I would I I just I I wouldn't want to fucking spend any of my money because I know the game is going to be crapola. <laughs> it really would. I mean, it's not going to be like fucking Morrowind. It's not going to be like Oblivion or Elder Scrolls. It's going to be crapola. It's going to be the biggest form of fucking crapola on the goddamn planet. <laughs> um. Uh. Yeah. That's that's basically pretty much about it. <laughs> crap on crap. Ah, uh, but anyways, guys, let me know in nasty, dear little comment, uh, fucking if you hate training agility as much as I do, and if you enjoyed this vlog, then you can thumbs up my living asshole, and, uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye!